for over half a century. Uh, we've been an electronic components distributor. We buy them in very large quantities and then we distribute to the individual customers. Sometimes that's an individual user, sometimes it's a company that's gonna use it. We have over 400,000 unique SKUs or parts in stock. One order items to 50 order items. It's items that are worth $30 to $20,000. You know, it's complex. You know, we're shipping out anywhere between 3,000 to 3,500 lines a day out the door all around the world. And in the end, our customers require on-time accurate delivery. From an operational perspective, we were at critical mass. We had to figure out a way to provide more capacity with the space that we had. Our sales team could sell more, we couldn't ship more. On average, pickers walk about six to seven miles a day. 70% of a picker's time was spent walking or searching for the product they needed to pick. If we wanted to double our business, if we wanted a goal of Master Electronics hitting a billion dollars in sales, there was no way that was gonna happen with the processes we had. We looked at several different options from uh, lift modules, vertical carousels, all sorts of things like that. Most of the people in our organization don't have a competency in automation. It required that trust, and uh, SwissLog is that trusted partner that I don't think we could have done this in any other way. First step with a SwissLog that took the longest was the due diligence. We had to get the right solution, and then we had to apply our own data science to it. What was going to be the right product mix? We knew not every part we have was going to go into it. While we were having this conversation with SwissLog, we were growing double digits. If you were to make a list of all the different things that this potentially can solve for you, um, you would have to pick three or four different products in the market today to kind of meet the needs that this one thing does. It's not that it was a good choice, I think it was probably the only choice. We're in about 370,000 square feet. Auto store takes up about 25,000 square feet. That 25,000 square feet has 80,190 bins. We're currently holding somewhere between 30 and 40,000 part numbers in there. We're about 84% full right now and still adding new parts every day. From the IT side of things, it's more for us about how do we optimize the system and make sure that it's, it's going to reach its ROI goals and that we're, we're using the system to its full capability and how it's gonna integrate with the things that we have in place and how is the software gonna drive those things. Our ERP system will receive an order from a customer. It does an allocation process where it determines what product is best gonna fit their needs and what product is going to be the easiest to fulfill. So there's a lot going on behind the scenes. The sync software allows you to establish priorities for different types of picks. And those things get escalated in the pick queue as they're batched out. The most powerful systems are intuitive, easy to use, easy to navigate. Those are all things that are in this sync software for sure. It's a touch screen environment. We've got photos of the product that uh, the picker is picking. One of the benefits of the sync software and the entire auto store setup is that we took that training time from about two weeks down to about an hour and a half and they could master it in that amount of time. We use a data-driven approach to try to understand the production metrics that are coming out of the system and what levers we have available to us to optimize those things. I'll just say it this way, it runs the system. So from the user experience, it's not only is it more efficient just bottom line, but the users that use it enjoy the experience of working with AutoStore much more than traditional picking, without a doubt. The pick rate is more than triple what the traditional pick rate is. Uh, our traditional picking team can do about eight to nine picks per hour. We're up over 30 per hour on Auto Store, and that's still climbing. We're still growing that competency. This is the heart of our operation now. It really transformed how we work as a company internally to achieve a big goal like this. That level of interaction and work between teams, you can't put a number on that. I think it's created a better work environment where people can work smarter, not harder. There's really nothing that we can't do in terms of providing solutions to our customers. As of right now, our on-time uh, shipment KPIs, our customer return KPIs are all at uh, historically good levels. We're breaking records almost every month. This is a monument to like our company being able to do big things and, and to get things done. There was no way we were gonna grow without Auto Store and Swiss Law.